Hi everyone, today we're going to talk about drone registration. I know it's a topic that a lot of people don't like to consider or think about, but it is a fact in the United States that when you purchase a drone, one of the very first things you need to do, if it weighs more than 250 grams or 0.55 pounds, is to register it with the Federal Aviation Administration. And the reason is this is an aircraft. It's not just a toy. It is an aircraft. It's considered an aircraft by the FAA, so it has to be registered. Now, even if it weighs less than that, you will still need to register it if you plan to use your drone for any sort of commercial purposes. Now, it's been about three years since I made a video about this, and a few things have changed since then. Actually, quite a bit has changed, so the information is pretty outdated in my previous video. So this information is current as of August 2024. Also, the last time I made a video on this topic, I did a drone giveaway to celebrate 150,000 subscribers. So I suppose I should do something similar to help celebrate 300,000 subscribers. So I'll tell you more about that at the end of the video and how that's gonna go. So the first thing that I wanna briefly mention, just as I did before, is the fact that there is one website and one website only where you should register your drone with the FAA. It's faadronezone.faa.gov. Now there are a few third party companies out there. Actually, there's quite a few less than there were three years ago. I think there's only a couple now, but these companies try to sort of trick you to believe that you need to pay more than that $5 for registering your drone. Now, the last time I made a video like this, I called them scammers, which was maybe just a little bit too harsh because what they're doing is more like deceptive marketing, I guess. And now that I think about it, actually, that's pretty much the definition of a scammer. So avoid those websites, you guys. It costs only $5 to register as a drone pilot with the FAA. But if you decide someday you want to register as a Part 107 commercial UAV pilot, then what you'll have to do is pay $5 for each individual drone. The bottom line, visit this website right here on the screen to register your drone. So what I'd like to do now is show you what that process looks like. So you're gonna go into your address bar and your computer, you're gonna type in faadronezone.faa.gov and it's gonna look just like this. So the first thing you need to do is register an account with the FAA. So you're gonna click right here. Then you'll need to agree to the system's use notice. Then you'll enter your basic information. You'll be sent an email verification link. So go ahead and open up your email account, find that email and click on verify my account. Once you are verified, then you can log in with those credentials. The next step is to add a service. So the thing about this website is they have many different services and one of them is to register as a drone pilot or register a drone. So what you'll do is you'll scroll down and select drone pilots, add a service, then scroll down to click on add a service. Of course, you're gonna do multiple things. This is a government website. Then you're gonna click on launch drone owners dashboard. Then right here is where most of you will choose to register as a part 107 or a recreational account. Part 107 is if you plan to use your drone for anything other than recreational purposes. Most of you are gonna choose set up a recreational flyer account. Then you're gonna go ahead and enter all of your demographics and proceed to check out. Then it's gonna bring you to the acknowledgement of safety guidance, click on next. And then the next step is to actually add your drone. It took a long time to get here, but what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on add device, and then you will start entering the information about your drone. You can give it a nickname if you want, what company, what sort of drone. And then you're gonna enter the remote ID serial number. Now you only have to do this if your drone weighs more than 250 grams. To find what your serial number is, for most drones, you can find that by starting your drone and your controller, your app on your mobile device or whatever, and you're gonna to head to the About section, and right there you're gonna see all of your serial numbers. You're gonna enter the device serial number into the Remote ID serial number box, and it will automatically transfer the data to the rest of the form. Go ahead and click on Done, and then click on Check Out. You're gonna go ahead and enter your credit card information and then go ahead and pay and you are finally done. Now in the future, if you happen to get another drone and you wanna remain a recreational drone pilot only, it's gonna look a little bit different because you won't have to pay another $5. 
You can find your registration number also if you click on Manage Device Inventory right here. This is where you're going to see all of your drones that you have registered. Now that number, they're going to be given a number, an FAA number, and you, what you have to do is you have to post that number on the exterior of your drone somehow. Now you can use a cheap label maker, you can simply write the number on a piece of paper and tape it to the side of the drone. Whatever works for you, it really doesn't matter just as long as it's visible on the exterior. Now one thing that you shouldn't do, at least in my opinion, is to pay for some overpriced fancy stickers from a third party company. That's totally up to you, but to me it just seems unnecessary and it's a waste of money. Now the next thing that you have to do is take the trust exam. Every single drone pilot needs to take the trust exam. And I know it sounds, oh God, I wanna take another test, but here's the deal. It's about as simple of a test that you're ever gonna find in life. It's free, it's super easy. You can learn more about it on the FAA website. And then also right there, you'll find links to all of the authorized trust test administrators. The FAA does not administer the test, but they have approved a bunch of like companies that you can go to and take take this exam. So just choose any of those, it really doesn't matter. I took the UAV Coach one because I was familiar with that platform. That's the platform that I used to study for my part 107. Um, you do need 100% on the trust exam to pass it, but you can take it as many times as you want. And it literally takes less than 30 minutes, you guys. And you'll get a certificate at the end. You can print that off when you're done. Make sure you keep that in a safe place. I just keep mine in my drone case all of the time because the test administrator, the company, whichever one you use, to take the test does not keep a record of your exam. It doesn't keep any records at all. So if you lose that printed certificate and you wanna have another one, you need to repeat the exam. That piece of paper is the only proof that you took the trust exam. So there are two very simple yet required things that you need to do before you can do anything else with your drone. Once again, the website is linked below. I'll put it up on the screen one more time. Do not use any other website than that to register your drone. Now, one more reminder, if the drone you have weighs less than 250 grams or 0.55 pounds, then you do not need to register it if you're just gonna fly recreationally. If you're just gonna fly for fun, you don't have to register it. You don't have to do any of that. You should still take the trust exam, but you don't have to register the drone. And this also means that you don't have to worry about complying with remote ID because remote ID is tied to registration. But the second you decide to use that brand new mini drone, no matter how much it weighs to make a dollar or to help a business, then you have to register it. So I hope that makes sense. If you do have any questions about how any of that works, let me know in the comments and I will answer every single question that you guys have. Now, let's do a little celebratory giveaway for this channel hitting 300,000 subscribers. I still can't believe it. That is a massive number of folks that have found enough value here to click on that beautiful subscribe button. And I wanna thank each and every one of you for all of the support over the past seven years. The growth of this channel has been like stunning and it's been consistent. And I think the reason for that is because I have such a wonderful base of supporters from the very beginning. This, is, this has been a wonderful experience and I wanna thank you all. The least I can do is do a little bit of a giveaway just to show my appreciation. So what I'm gonna do for this giveaway, it's a little bit different. I've never done this before. Uh, let me grab this. So I have a whole bunch of these PGY Tech backpacks sling bags, all kinds of stuff from PGY Tech. I don't even know how many bags I have, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fill this full of stuff for my studio. Some stuff will be new, some stuff will be slightly used that I've done a video review on, but it's gonna be packed full. I think it's 25 liters, I'm not sure. But this alone is like a 225, I think, dollar valued item. The stuff inside will be worth even more than that. I'm gonna do more of these because what I'm doing is I'm clearing out my studio I'm getting rid of this clutter because it's not only cluttering my space, it's cluttering my mind, and I just need to clear it out. The other reason I'm clearing it out is because next year, I am building a new studio, and I'm getting out of my basement, and I'm gonna have a nice, dedicated studio. So I'm not gonna move all of this over to the new studio, all right? Um, so I'm gonna sell some of it on Gear Focus because some of it is too valuable to give away, uh, but even then, it's gonna be like a 50% discount. So if there's, something you're looking for, check out Gear Focus. I'll put a link for that in the video description and you get a good deal there. But most of it, 90% of it, I'm gonna give away, you guys, because it's not worth the hassle to sell all of this stuff. Like, it's just too much to deal with. So to be eligible 
to possibly win this grab bag right here, uh, I ask you to do three things. You don't have to do anything if you don't want to, but to be eligible to win, do these three things. Number one, be a subscriber to the channel. That's pretty obvious, right? Be a subscriber. Most of you watching right now are subscribers. I really appreciate that. Second thing, check out my Amazon storefront link in the video description. On that Amazon storefront is everything that I have love, everything that I use to make this channel successful. My drones, my portable power stations, my ride-ons, all of my tech gear, all of my video production equipment, my real estate gear, some fun stuff that I just use that is tech related. It's all tech related stuff. Check that out. Look through it. You don't have to buy anything. I don't expect you to buy anything. If you want to, great. That really helps. That gives me affiliate revenue, just a little bit of revenue, but it adds up. And that affiliate revenue is what's going to help me build this studio. It's going to be pretty expensive. So if you want to buy something, if you need to buy anything, I appreciate that, but you don't have to. All right. Then what you're going to do is after reviewing that Amazon storefront, come back here and comment on this video and just tell me one thing that really caught your eye on that Amazon storefront. Maybe there's something that you're like, Hey, I didn't know this even existed. So just let me know what it is. And that way I know that you checked out my Amazon storefront. And then secondly, I have a way to contact you. So what I'm going to do on August 19th, 2024, I'm going to just randomly choose one of the comments from this video right here. And I'll reply to your comment saying, Hey, you won. And I'll say something else. That's not just what I'm going to say, but I'm gonna let you know that you won the grab bag. And then what I'll do is I'll ask for your email, I'll ask you to post your email and then I'll email you and we'll get in touch and I'll get your shipping information. and I'll send this off to you right away. Now, here's the thing, you guys, anytime there's a giveaway on YouTube, many of you know, there are many, many scammers and there's probably going to be a lot of people saying, Hey, you won click here uh, to claim your prize. I won't do that. I won't say click here. Don't click on any links. All right. And if you get a reply to your comment from me or what looks like me, just make sure it's me. Number one, I'll have a check mark, check mark by my logo. And you know, where it said 51 drones, it'll be my picture. I'll have a check mark. I'm the only one that will have the check mark. Also, if you want to go ahead and just click on it and make sure it's me and make sure I have 300,000 subscribers because scammers will create a fake YouTube account and then they'll expect you to click on it. I will never charge you for shipping. I will not charge you. This giveaway will cost you nothing. So if anyone asks you to send them a penny, then run away. They are scamming you. All right. So this is a free giveaway. I'm not charging you anything. All right. So keep that in mind. Uh, but anyway, I'll get your email. I'll ship it to you and you'll be very happy and I'll be happy to get rid of the stuff. Now, just a couple of other things. This giveaway is only for us residents. I apologize, but it's just not reasonable for shipping. Uh, to any other country right now. It's just super, super expensive. And also this giveaway is not sponsored or endorsed by anybody except for myself. So good luck to everybody. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for the amazing support over the past seven years, especially over the past year with my wife's um, health matters. And it's going very well. She's doing very well. We're almost done with the entire process. So thank you for that continued support and those continued prayers. That really, really means a lot to my family. So Thanks again, guys. Let me know if you have any questions also in the comments. Um, click on the like button. Don't forget to do that also. Uh, so this video gets some traffic. Have a great day. And as always, fly safe and fly smart.